Hey guys, Tim Mitchell here. I want to come today with another frequently asked question about online marketing and marketing your business online. Today's question is, should I start a blog? And how to start a blog? Well, there's two different blogs you can start. One's a free blog and one's a paid blog or a self-hosted blog. So today we're going to start talk about this, the free blogs. These are very easy to set up and they don't cost you anything you can set one up immediately some of the better websites to go to there's hundreds and hundreds of different places you can go to set up a website and to set up a blog on someone else's domain the advantage of these is that you are riding on somebody else's popularity and and a page rank you know wordpress.com blogger.com hubpages.com and squidoo.com are are some of the ones that I use more frequently or I suggest that people use more frequently they seem to be some of the better ones you know, the advantage like I say it's free it's easy and you get to ride their kind of ride their coattails on being an authority site the disadvantages of course are it's not your website so you have no real control over it you don't have any control over a lot of the things in the website you can only basically post content and change the way it looks you don't have any uh, any other options, and this also can be taken away to taken away at any time. You know the, I mean, for, say for example, somebody can always log into your website and say that they don't like it, and it can be reviewed and maybe possibly taken down. The website could close its doors. Anything could happen because it's not your property. Uh, but if you want to go to them, that's they're a great place to go, and I personally do go to them also. But you, they're easy to do. Just go to those websites, WordPress, Blogger, Hubpages, or Squidoo.com, any of those. Follow the prompts on the pages. You, know, you want to make sure that you're adding good content. You want to add videos wherever possible. You want to add images. You want to inform and educate your visitors. And you want to make something that people want. Okay, now what these will, these will make links back to your website and you can get traffic back to your website through this through these blogs so just by adding links and adding information you can get people to come to your website that's going to lead to more clients more leads more customers and ultimately more money so it's very essential I think that you should start a blog free is good hosted self hosted is better if you're ready to learn to market your business online with videos and free reports Go sign up today at OnlineTulsaMarketing.com. Again, that's OnlineTulsaMarketing.com. I have about 20 videos uh, that, I, that I'll set you up with, a handful of free reports and guides that I just give out to you as, as good general content. They are all have some kind of tip, trick, or advice that you can use and you can apply in your business today. So go sign up today at OnlineTulsaMarketing.com, enter your information, and I'll talk to you soon.